Hello friends, it is Chelsea aka Hungry Hungry Hippo and welcome on back to another plan with me. This week I'm going to be planning for the week of May the 2nd through the 9th, or excuse me, the 8th, 2nd through the 8th of 2022. I used this really cute printable kit from White Rose Printables called Fangirl. It was a Star Wars sort of Kylo Ren inspired kit and I paired it with a foil bundle from Scribble Prints Co. in her sparkly red right? Yeah, sparkly red hearts. <laughs> because this kit is all about like, I love you Kylo, which I do love Kylo. I don't know if I love him more than like, you know, anybody else, but like, whatever. Um, I don't know what I'm trying to say. This is the kit. This is the base. I did use the bougie boxes. We made this kit extra sparkly. We made this red extra sparkly this week. Let's go ahead and get started. So I thought before I zoomed in too far that I would show you guys the sidebar. I did track reading and no, yeah, no spend in reading. I didn't mark my reading, but I'm pretty sure I read like every day, but maybe Monday and Friday. I don't even remember. Um, these are my dinners. Friday was blank because I guess I forgot what I, I didn't write it down, what I ate. And then I had to do some stuff on like a, just a checklist on the sidebar. So yeah, let's zoom in. Sorry for shaking you guys so much. Let's get started. So the first thing that I'm going to mark on Monday is that I went to the library. Oh, I also should mention I did create scripts for myself. I don't remember the name of the script. They're the font that I used, so I will try to link it for you guys down in the description box below. But pretty much anything that you see that is red foiled is from the kit or from the foil bundle because where else am I going to get red foil? I don't know. So did a grocery run. I just used a piece of deco from the kit as well as the grocery run sticker from the bundle. And then I did upload a video and again used another piece of the icon from the foil bundle. Moving on. Marking that I packed my lunch and I didn't pull anything to mark these. So I don't I mean, obviously I'm going to have to pull something, but I don't know what, I don't know what we're going to use. So I guess we'll just let that chill for a minute, just right there. And we'll figure that out in a little bit. And then I took a shower and got some happy mail. What did I get on this day? Monday, I got a order from Press Press. I did put in a non-happy uh, or non-mystery kit order, which you guys will actually see next, next plan with me. Moving on to Tuesday, the first thing I'm going to mark is that I did have to work, of course. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and every other Friday is my work schedule, in case you are curious. And then I did have to um, give some money to my boss. We went together to get my co-workers a nice wedding present. Oh no, oh no. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. I was like, oh no. Oh no. Thing is, I thought things were happening that were not supposed to be happening, but they did happen. So, they are happening and they were supposed to be happening. So then I did try on some clothes, which again, I did not pull a sticker for. What is happening? Did I not? Okay, I did pull some stickers, but I didn't pull all of them. I would say I would pull them, but I don't really know what even I would use. So tried on some clothes because I got an order in the mail from Shein. I ordered some dresses for my coworker's wedding, which I didn't actually end up going to, but that's okay. Well, it's not okay, but it is. It was going to have to be. So it's done, it's done. Um, and then I did have to work on this day. This is Wednesday, moving on with our lives. I did pack my lunch as well. Again, did not pull anything to go with that. I may just pull some deco. And then I did get some happy mail on this day. And then I did get some diamond painting stuff done. I had ordered a ton of diamond painting stuff online or from Amazon. So I'm sure all of the previous Amazon happy mails that you have seen over the last few weeks have been because of that. And then I also did get my, like, stimulus. They sent, like, another small stimulus, which was nice of them. Nice. 
I guess. And yeah, so that got posted on this day. And then I also have this script. This is from Carly Plans and it says Star Wars Day and I don't know where to put it. I guess up here. But it's going to cover up the... Um... We'll just put it there, I guess. That'll work. You can't hardly see it, but that's okay. Moving on to the second half of the week. I am super tired. I've hit a major wall all of a sudden, you guys. Holy cow. Holy cow. Come on, really? Good gosh. Okay, here we go. So, again, the first thing I'm going to mark on Thursday is that I had to work. Come on, come up. Work. Did some more diamond painting on this day. Am I going to have enough room? No. This is the, I will say, this is the nice thing about using the bougie boxes. Everything seems to pull up very nicely off of them. Just put that right there, and then I guess we're just going to let this... I was going to say that was probably a really dumb decision, but you know what? It actually kind of worked out, so... It's a little sticky, but that's okay, because we'll just use the script to cover it up. So, yeah, there you go had to work. I did print my paste up because I was getting paid on the next day. Did some diamond painting, of course. And then I did finish reading The Butcher. It was really good. I really quite enjoyed it. I guess I should also mention I was reading um, Project Hail Mary during this week, too. So, And then I'm going to mark that we had a family dinner night on this evening. And then I also do have a Cinco de Mayo script here, again, from Carly Plans, and I guess we'll just stick it right here, because I don't know where else to put it, even though you can't really see it, but there it is. Friday, um, finished also reading Tar or, uh, Project Hail Mary, and then started reading Dark Horses. Holy cow, there's a bunch of stuff to mark on this day. What the heck, man? I took a shower. I had the day off, so I was obviously incredibly productive. Took a shower, uploaded what question mark? Blackout, the blackout plan with me, which would have been again 2.0. I did schedule my loan payment to get posted. Um, since I schedule it on Friday, it usually doesn't come out until Mondays, but that's whatever, it is what it is. And then I also had to wash bedding. Laundry uh, washer is from the foil bundle. Had to water my plants. The spray bottle is also from the foil bundle. And then also played some Minecraft on this day. And then I guess we're going to mark down here at the bottom that it was payday. Even though I usually get paid like first thing in the morning. But that's okay. And that is from the um, foil bundle as well. On Saturday morning... Uh, woke up and did some diamond painting, and then the lovely news of the day was that my car wouldn't start, which was very much a bummer. I was not really happy about that at all, as you can imagine, and it continued to not start for pretty much the end of its days. Somebody's shooting off fireworks, imagine that. And then we also had to make a trip to Bluffton, so I just used a star from the foil bundle. And then we went to Muncie, which is about 45 minutes away from where I live, to look at cars. And they just had nothing that I wanted, which was, I mean, I would say it's a bummer. But, like, I I was pretty particular about what car I wanted. So that night I actually went online and looked at cars and found the one that I wanted. The big news of the most recent couple of weeks is that I did get a new car. I was super happy about it. Thank goodness. Like, let me tell you, I was definitely in need of a new car. So I'm very happy that I got one. This week was full of holidays. This week was Mother's Day. Again, it used another script from Carly Plans. So, in honor of that, we had a family barbecue. 
and I watched Falcon and Winter Soldier. I started, I think, episode two or three on this day. I'm super behind. I did finally finish it, which I'm sure most of you guys are like, it's about damn time. Let me tell you, you're not alone in that decision, in that particular opinion. I'm going to zoom out and then we'll put my pages back in my planner and I'll drag it over here so you can see it looks super cute let me tell you look at this isn't this cute I'm very happy with it super duper happy with it oh my goodness let me show you everything I had left so I can get it out of the cello so like I mentioned used a red heart sparkly red hollow or sparkly red foil bundle from squirrel prince co in the hearts um i ended up what did i do oh i used so i used the like solid hearts that are on the um boxes over the full box on the like, headers over the full boxes and then i used the other like confetti ish hearts on the um the rest of the headers Good lord, I don't know what I'm trying to say, you guys. And here is everything I left in this kit. This was a printable kit from White Rose Printables. These kits are massive and have a ton of stickers. So here is the finished spread. A little viv wiggle to show off that lovely um, sparkly red foil. Good lord, can't talk. I'll be alright eventually. That is this plan with me. Thank you all so very much for watching. And until I see you next time, bye bye